Hello and welcome back to Digital Assets Daily. Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, wherever you are in your corner of the world. We're going to get into a few articles on the discussion of Zenfin. Learn a little bit about that for you new investors and for the engine wallet as a place to hold, but also as an exchange for ease of use to actually purchase your XDCE, the Zenfin token. All right, as we move on into the discussion here, what is Zenfin? Zenfin is a hybrid blockchain technology company focused on international trade and finance. We have developed a highly scalable, secure, permissioned, and commercial grade blockchain architecture. Zenfin blockchain is powered by XDC protocol, which is built over the first of its kind hybrid blockchain architecture to eliminate the inefficiencies in global trade and financing to enable institutions provide real time settlement as well as enabling cross-border smart contracts. XDC protocol is architected to support smart contracts layer, KYC AML layer, and price stability using its hedge pool for existing cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin BTC, Bitcoin Cash, BCH, Litecoin LTC, and Ripple XRP on its tradefinex.org platform. The XDC protocol also supports fiat payment methods and will support upcoming nationally issued cryptocurrencies. In the XDC ecosystem, if you're viewing your screen as we scroll past it, has a little diagram there on how the system works. The Zenfin hybrid blockchain and XDC protocol for global trade and finance. A little uh, video. And then you have their advisors. Those of you who are probably familiar with Roger Ver, you have Mate Toke, and you have Jason Butcher, and Sydney Evergan, and the Simon Bowles. The links will always be available in the description below, so you can further research all of these at your own pleasure, if you decide. Here you have about the team. Don't really want to go into all of that because it's on like a, a little. Um, like an automated system here. If I start getting into those, I'm not sure if I can pause that and going back and forth and back and forth. But definitely, if you have the time, take a look at their team, where they're from, and what their specialist or their specialty is as a specialist in the industry. As we scroll past here, the little testimonial section and their featured in section. You're going to have the Trade Finex, which we will discuss. Trade Finex is a peer to peer decentralized platform powered by XDC for trade finance originators to distribute deals to a wide range of bank or non bank funders. Trade Finex is interoperable with a wide range of trade finance digitization platforms. Connect your origination platforms to a wide network of funders and get access to the secondary market distribution marketplace. Then you have the TradeFinex platform peer to peer trade and financing blockchain tech video that you can play there if you're interested. Then they have their white paper um, learn about the different blockchain apps and usage in real world scenarios and obtain a greater understanding of the development side technical part along with the business side application part of the blockchain based platforms technical white paper and the business white paper and my apologies there is construction going on here at my place so it may be a little bit loud i'm trying my best to move along through it as we're still in all of the quarantine with four kids and two dogs so we're trying to squeeze in the shows around the best time that I can. What is XDCE? Zenfin has released a swappable token under the ticker XDCE. Releasing an ERC-20 token has a wide array of benefits for traders, private investors, and institutional level partners. The XDCE token will largely be for traders to compete against other ERC-20 tokens across exchange boards, making Zenfin's reach more versatile in the open crypto market and can be swapped with the standard XDC token and the XDC E token will be available and will be tradable on most exchanges. This means traders will reap the benefit of high volume and quick trades through multiple exchanges. 
Traders by using the XDC e-token will allow for the XDC token to be used primarily for institutional level partners. Most importantly, this will also allow the XDC to grow strictly from use cases, all the while keeping traders using XDCE connected and benefiting from the growth of XDC. Here's a little token distribution graph. As you can see, founders and core team allocated locked up 25%. The ecosystem development pool for Zenfin organization is 15%. Pre-placement and follow-on token offerings at 10%. Ecosystem participation incentives through institutions hosting master nodes is 32.5%. And the allocation for hedge pool is 10%. The philanthropic and social cause 5% and contingency supply is 2.5% in transparency. And then you have the milestone and roadmap. If you are available to view your screen, please do so if you're only safe, not driving or working. Don't find yourself in trouble being distracted. If you're new to this channel, we do try to make the channel where you can listen and come back and watch later if you're interested or come back to the channel to see the um, links available in the description below as we do tend to have a lot of busy people watching and following our show on their executive careers we do permit that you can have your headset your bluetooth on and go for a jog go for a ride or driving through your car whatever you're doing just to make it simple for you so we do tend to have a little bit of a different program and our program here tends to be a little different also than if we are guests on other shows where we tend to probably be a little um, less focused as we're trying to deliver the content information. Also, too, as I continue to get direct messages and um, comments in the description below that I often forget to hit the like and subscribe and sharing of our content. Those of you who have been much appreciated Thank you very much. Uh, we do notice a lot of that on Twitter as the time is very minimal with a busy schedule. I just want to personally say thank you to every one of you uh, for uh, following and supporting this channel. Here we have the milestone and roadmap from 2017, 2018. There are steps along the way as they grow up to 2019 and continued on to current um, in the 2020. Next article I want to discuss is uh, the XDC, XDCE as utility. You can buy from the links below. XDCE can be used to deploy distributed applications on the XTC protocol. Here's the uh, ticker symbol for basically, um, I guess, retail market, as the other XDC is stated to be for the institutional level, but it can be traded one for one. The current price at the time of this article here, we know it's um, uh, compared to ETH, sorry, um, as a lot of people um, are interested in this in the US for the USD conversion, and we will get to that shortly. The exchange and wallet partners, you have the Biloxi Fat BTC, the Hotbit, the HomeX, uh, P2P and B2B, Indodax, Ladokan, the top btc.com, Kos, Mer, uh, Mercatox, the Bancor, IDEX, Ether Flyer, Fork Delta, and Ether Delta. And then the supporting wallets are the MetaMask, My Ether Wallet, the IDU, Lumi uh, Wallet, Trust Wallet, and SafePal. If I'm not mistaken, Trust Wallet is Binance. I'm pretty confident there. Uh, My Ether Wallet is also available through your uh, Nanos, like your Ledger but also too which is not stated and maybe they'll probably pass this along if someone hears this show today to add the ledger live the ledger live has updated from nano has updated their content so you can have the xdce directly on your nano s or x onto the ledger live along with your xrp your stellar uh, your pundi x holochain and whatever else you may put on that ledger live the new updates allow for a lot of new tokens so if you do use ledger check it out because you might be surprised and find it there um, but it's very simple and i'm going to get into more options as well if i'm not mistaken i believe the xdc trading now live on the below exchange stacks 
I do believe um, is the credit card purchase if you're interested. And if I'm not mistaken, the Alpha X is where you can trade out your XDC for XDCE. Um, if I am off on that, please feel to free to comment in the comment section below. I believe I'm accurate on that and then we will move on. And again, here you have, if you have your Android app downloaded from your Google Play, you have the XTC wallet here and the Zen Pay wallet there. You also, the iOS, go into your app store and you can um, download as well. The, we're going to get into that next, um, the, like the um, engine wallet. So we'll, we'll get into that in a few seconds. The Zenfin network price, USD is 0 0.0045. It is, let me see if I can refresh this really quick to make sure that we have the most frequent. There we go. Is up point uh, or plus 7.06% uh, in a 24-hour cycle. So if you got some Zenfin or XDCE yesterday, then today you've already made 7.06% gains. Um, as we were mentioning, get into the um, engine. You can go directly into Google Play or your App Store, download the engine. It's a Bitcoin, Ethereum, blockchain, crypto wallet. Now we're going to discuss that. You obviously click your install and have it. The cool thing with the engine wallet, not only is it just your wallet, but it has an exchange internally built in and it's pretty exciting and pretty interesting i've never seen uh, something so easily in my life um, if you've been here for five plus years then you understand what i'm talking about to get currencies i mean it could be a 10 plus step um, scenario for you to do it what we can discuss here the reason i had to also put up the coinbase because it is an Ethereum-based token, one of the easy steps I find living in the U.S. is going to Coinbase, getting your Ethereum. After having downloaded the Engine Wallet, send your Ethereum there. And then after you have your Ethereum, you're going to click on Exchange right here. It will pull up the... Let me just breeze through really quick and see if it offers that. I guess it's not going to on the site. Either which way, you will click the exchange, and then the top, it'll have one right above the other. The top will be your Ethereum that you will use to exchange for the Zenfin XDCE, and then you can say what amount you would like it to be. The great thing is, is it's an all automated system, and you are going to use the, um, the same wallet partners here from the thing and many a times you're going to end up probably using the bank or directly on the engine wallet as it will give you I think it's somewhere between three and five different options of the exchanges directly that are built in so let's get into meet your new blockchain wallet impenetrable feature packed and convenient built for traders gamers and developers you can download from Google Play and from the App Store Reclaim your privacy, no annoying ads, zero trackers, your private keys are your own, paper-powered, 12-word passphrase backup, and you can manage infinite wallets, create, import, use, and track an infinite number of blockchain wallets, all in a streamlined, easy-to-use app, and enjoy seamless browsing. Interact with any dApp with a single click of a button without leaving the safety of your blockchain wallet. And I have to say, I was pretty impressed with that capability. As you could drop your Ethereum on, you could browse through the other assets, and you could use them to exchange directly on your wallet without ever leaving the safety and security. And I found that very exciting after having been here for a few years and then realizing the challenging and difficult um, uh, issues that you could have on getting uh, altcoins. And here we have um, protect your assets, turn your phone into a hardware like blockchain wallet. Engine keyboard built from scratch, protect you from any form of data sniffing 
or key loggers. This is a really cool thing too here. Whenever you do go to uh, transfer your Ethereum into your wallet, it'll show up. Like it's a very quick system. It's very efficient. I was also again impressed again. So once you have it in there and you do decide to use the exchange and you're going to convert to your Ethereum into a Zenfin, then it will request that you do um, add your password again before every exchange. And I think that is a great thing even on your wallet to minimize the accidents that you could possibly have. You know, the way you pocket dial or pocket order or something going on in your pocket. That's a little extra protection. And then you have convert with ease, swap hundreds of tokens from thousands of available trading pairs from Changely, KyberSwap, Bancor, and CoinSwitch. And as you breeze through that exchange, it's a pretty solid selection of different altcoins that are available in there. And then stash your collectibles, claim, scan QR codes to instantly claim free blockchain gaming assets, trade securely, store, buy, and sell blockchain assets and collectibles, and then link your wallet to blockchain games and apps via a code or a QR scan. And I do like that if you have your other PC available and you have the app on your phone and you go to transfer from this wallet directly into your Ledger Live, you can just simply scan your QR code directly from your mobile app. And there you have it. It doesn't get much easier than that. Very impressed with you guys. Congrats to Engine for building and designing such an impressive wallet. And then here you have the Samsung blockchain wallet, Samsung Galaxy awaits. We've partnered with Samsung to seamlessly integrate the engine wallet with the Galaxy S10. And they finalized their site with download the engine wallet today. We take security seriously and so should you. Available Google Play and the App Store. And again, as we've mentioned, here is the actual site. And that's what it's going to look like if you download it. You go and you're going to find the white E inside the little purple circle. And I hope that was helpful as we had been requested for the past week to start discussing uh, Zenfen. And then as of yesterday, we were... Uh, discussing engine so I felt it best just to make a, a video especially since we on Twitter today had mentioned this in regards to an article we shared previously this morning in regards to engine and Zenfin so here we have it if you are looking on how to best do it there you have it now you're going to have all the information and I don't really know of an easier way than through the engine wallet to get the Zenfin token Alright guys, we're going to leave you with a final thought. Doing what you like is freedom. Liking what you do is happiness. And again, it's not financial advice. It is for entertainment purposes only. Again, thanks all of you for your support. Don't hesitate to hit the like, share, and subscribe. And we appreciate each and every one of you. Until the next one.